Hey, how's it going? This is Sexy Cat here, showing my uh, StarCraft game I just played. A real silly one against this, uh, um, uh, <clears throat> In the top right, you have your Zerg player, Sexy Cat. Woo woo, go Sexy Cat, yeah! And in the top right, left, in the teal, we have the enemy foreigner player. I think, I think most of the people I play are in South America. I actually don't know. Not entirely sure, but uh, you know, look at this. Look at this beginning of the game. Let's let's put it up to the a proper speed. This is the normal speed called fastest. Of course, it's the normal speed that you play a game. The fastest speed. How else do you think competitors would compete? The slowest? Are you shitting me? What are you thinking? <laughs> Check it. We're we we play like we're professional players. We play all the modes that are pro. As you can see, I am, uh, I apparently am sending my overlord in the incorrect direction of the opposing player, but that's okay. I kind of just default going south when I'm in this location, I don't know why. Um, this is the map Circuit Breakers, and, uh, it's my favorite map, so I always play it. Because maybe, maybe, I'll have an advantage somehow, because I like it. Perhaps. As you see, I'm also sending in my drone... Well, we'll see which direction. Is it south? Yes. Again, I'm sending in the wrong direction. He's not even... I don't know when Terran's supposed to send SCVs. No clue. I don't know how to fucking play this game. But look at this guy. He's Jansen real silly. He's trying to get somewhere. What is he going to go? Is he going to build something over here? No, no. He's going to build a supply depot on the walls. A wall? Is he going to build a wall? What is he doing? Yeah. Oh, it's a barracks. Why would he buy it? He already had a dip out. And uh, I'm already doing my pool. Because in the previous game... I also played a Terran player who rushed me, bunker rushed me, and uh, you know I fought quite valiantly with my drones. I gotta say I busted out his bunker; he wasn't repairing it, and uh, and I killed some Marines. But at that point, I was just hemorrhaging too bad. It was just too fast, too hard, and too fast. Tesagi, it is true. The Terrans are too powerful. The humans, what kind of Organic space alien compete with space guns. As you can see, the spawning pool has now arrived. I am at 300, so sending down that drone to make the hatchery in the expansion. I have a new overlord going west, and he will arrive eventually to that base. And look, this drone, he checked down here, there's nobody there, nobody there. Well, I guess he's, uh, he's gotta be up here, huh? That's where he's gotta be. Ah, oh, lucky last draw. What a, what a, this drone. Yeah, he has feelings. Alright, yes, I, I, you know, I remember this moment. As I noticed this drone. Your units are under attack. Oh my god, what's happening? Oh. Oh, look at this, he snuck a fucking little SCV up the crown. But you know what, I got two circling, he's gonna get him. Oh, so fucking, oh, tap the shit out of that SCV, Zerglings. Good job. You did so well that last game. Yeah, I didn't pay attention over there. You can only play attention in one place. Oh, look, he walled up. Oh, what a great wall with the SCV and everything. You're so silly. Oh, he's got a bunker. Oh, you can hide in the bunker? See, if I knew he was being defensive, I was trying to pretend to be aggressive. To fake aggressive, and then play a little more economy. Um, and defensive. I'm also really determined on this, like, no third base, or late third base idea. And I'm convinced to try to at least just play with it a bit. And try to see if I can pull it off, because it's the, it's the whole legend that Zerg has to have three bases against the Terran. Otherwise, they just can't compete. So, uh... Looks like Sexy Cat is sending out his overlord over into the enemy Terran base. Um, he is doing this to just observe because now he cannot get in through the front. He's got to come in through the air with the slow cow overlord. Oh, look! Overlord could just lose aerial vol If he just stopped floating and just fell on that marine. Ah, I believe... He, I bet the Overlord would... It would probably die if he fell. If he dropped. They're probably really fragile or something. Because otherwise... I would love to use the last Overlords. Look at that, all that minerals. I 
feel like I was... Okay, I got a lot of guys up here, Look, looks like. Don't know how many. Um, me as the past me. So, look at that, uh, Sunken Colonies. He's, he's, on, he's not even... Okay, so this is why it's really good to look at your games. Even after I observed, I still didn't observe anything useful. And right after my overlord died, looks at that, he's... He pounds out two factories. And what's that? An academy in the corner. So, I'm expecting a bunch of marines, like every single TVZ I play. So, of course, I got these sunken colonies. And I'm macroing, focusing on macro, going to a lair. I was thinking I was probably do some lurkers, you know. Um, or, I think I was doing... I'm trying to combine mutalisks with zerglings in a, like, a early-ish, mid-ish game. Against, like, I wanna, I wanna see if I can head on their Terran Force, he <clears throat> address them head on, that is. Look at these Zerglings, they're protecting this exit, they got this exit, I know if anything comes in or out. And look, they got a machine shop, and uh, an armory, and another factory. So, three factories he pulled on me, that little fucking asshole. <laughs> little piece of poo. What, you a little wall with a supply depot? Engineering bay in the front? I literally could attack him. Okay, I would have. Yeah, always oh, got four in there, four guys. But you know what? If I attacked him, if I didn't make these sunken colonies. Although I think I was pretty much hatching Zerglings this whole time, especially like right now. Damn! So this is good to see the replay. Now I knew if they <laughs> turtle up and make factories extremely early. Then you should probably attack with the zerglings you produced if you do that thing. Most people do not make zerglings. They mostly, um, you know, make a third base and then start. They just try to rush the defilers, use some lurkers to hold off stuff. I even want to use like hydralisks against. It just seems like Terran has such good counters to the zerg. It's so hard. But <laughs> ah. And for somebody who doesn't, who's like super insistent to not learn Mutalisk Micro, I have a different, I have a different angle. That's what I think. I think I should. Okay, so this is my idea that I was getting here. This was, this was interesting. So I got my layer. You see? Oh, look at that. I'm doing ventral sacks before menstrual velocity. I don't remember which one the other one is. Um, pneumatic carapace. Um, not vaginal velocities, or indictive pendulums what's they're just see look at that um already got ventral sacs pneumatic carapace coming in and uh so as you can see that's that's transportation option for overlord even though they're slow i could pick them up there and slowly bring them over and i got all these zerglings so me thinking me first observing that they're kind of they have a wall off in the front of course i had decided and I saw my overlord, there's like nothing over there. I had decided to try, I'll just throw a few zerglings up here. Let's try to just poke them in their base. Maybe it'll cause some harassment, you know, maybe the very least. And maybe the very least, then he's built some missile turrets up here, you know. Zerglings cost zero, as you know. They don't cost anything. Oh man, it's such a weird strat. I've never... I don't think I've even seen something like this before. Like, in, like, pro games and stuff. I don't know if I knew at that point what killed me. I probably didn't. I probably still assumed, unless I did know, maybe would I make some more Mutalists? I mean, it's a pretty hard counter to... That's pretty much the exact counter to my build that I was trying, the, um... Uh, Zergling Mutalists? Look at that. Tanks. Goliaths are, are not bad against Zerglings. Especially paired with the range of the... But look at this. Oh, man. And Sexy Cat has arranged some Zerglings to travel across this cliff using the Overlord. Going inside their ventral sacks. Traveling briskly through the air with their pneumatic carapace. Comes the Zerglings with one carapace. And you know what? I didn't pay attention to this battle at all because I, I literally... I pretty much knew I was done for. Oh, I actually did pretty fair in this. I was more focusing on my attack. But you know what if I did, if I maybe just focus fired 
the tanks a little more, I, I probably could have been in much better shape. But look, like, what am I supposed to do against that? But look at that up here! Oh, Zerglings are in your base! All your base are belong to us. All your base are belong to us. Oh, what is he? What is he got nothing. He's got nothing over here. Except these guys. They're coming up. But look at that. Oh, I'm all up in his base. He's not even... He's sieging my base from afar, slowly. Look at that. Ah. You... That's so satisfying. At this point, it wasn't about winning. It was about just having that mini glory. I mean, I knew it. I was dead. I didn't really have any hard counter with all these Goliaths. Look, he's all those minerals. Oh, he's supply blocked. I destroyed one supply depot. Oh, I... Something else here. Uh, sub destroying supply depots, which actually was a terrible idea, because you got to rebuild those. And so... Ah, oh, man. What do you do against these Goliaths? And these tanks. Oh, I snuck a guy down here. Or no, not yet. Yeah, here. Just, you know. He's all over here. Oh, they're attacking! I tried to snipe out the turret. And I thought I would be in red enough to go. I just kind of like... You had to be decisive and try to go back. I actually save... Do I save them? No, probably not. Building more mutalisks. So I just try to see if I can do some damage. It's pretty much this... This hard contain is just really too rough for the sexy cat, unfortunately. And look, he forgot about this drone. And look, the attack's already over. Even though there's nobody... He's nobody mining over there. He doesn't need to. He's got these assholes in the front. It's fucking fortified. He's got a thousand minerals. 600 gas. What does he care about? Nothing, I tell ya. He's got the game in the bag, and I'm just holding out because I like to see experiences. I like to test out test out little battles, especially against humans. So, uh, I was just seeing if I could make any kind of damage. He didn't have to slowly drain me. He could have probably went in, but he's probably reinforced. He's probably just so sh shell-shocked from my attack. It's really strange that he's not re-empowering it up here. I mean, he's not... <clears throat> oh, did I give up already? I thought I had a sweet attack. Not a sweet attack. Okay, look at this. Three Zerglings and Overlord. Oh, holy cow. What is he gonna do? Ah, oh, I did... See, I did the splash damage. That's kind of... It's kind of... I practiced, like, dropping on tanks, basically. On, like, huge tank lines. And so... And I, I've just found out that, like... It's like the best way to drop on them. I guess the best way is to use like lurkers, zerglings, defilers, and overlord. Key, key map them that you can immediately drop. You first drop something to take damage, and then you drop the defiler, and then you cast dark swarm, and then and that's like fucking awesome. That's that's fucking golden right there. So I had all those minerals, so I made a couple more hatcheries. It's just seeing what I could do. I knew if I had a lot... I mean, I had all the minerals, so if I made a bunch of Zerglings, I knew... I knew enough Zerglings these guys couldn't handle. Man, they really... So many of the guy, Goliaths, though, they all do instant damage to Zerglings, and they all do 12 damage. Shit. Well, that's a Sexy Cat episode for ya. It's, uh... Hope you enjoyed, and hope you come around next time, I tell ya. And if you don't come around next time, then I hope you have a good...